And now, CBS 4 Sports with Clay Williams. For the UT Rio Grande Valley women's basketball team, it's very simple. Beat Cal State Bakersfield today at the WAC Tournament semifinals in Las Vegas, and you have guaranteed yourself your second straight postseason tournament. Either the women's NIT with a second place or the NCAA tournament, the big dance, if they can grab a WAC tournament title. Vaqueros, Roadrunners, taken off today in Las Vegas. Shantae Goff, the WAC Player of the Year, gets fouled, and then somehow... Makes the bucket. She led the Vaqueros with 24 points and three steals. This one went to not one, but two overtimes when it was tied at 65. Second OT, Tylen Carter with a backwards layup right there, and Bakersfield has the lead. But watch this. Off the great defense, Raquel Preston coming down on the top of your screen. 5.9 seconds left, makes the layup. And that is the layup that would win the game for UTRGV. They win it 73-72, the final in two overtimes. Raquel Preston, the only senior on the floor, said there was no way she was missing that one. Going into that layup, I missed like 12. So I wasn't going to miss that one. I, didn't, I wasn't going to miss that one. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Until, well, you know, gave us a, a speech about history and things, you know, that's never been done in the school. And we realize what's on the line. You know, we, of course, we're not going to make every shot. We're not going to grab every rebound. It's not on purpose. And we just got to get back and keep playing defense. And I feel like our defense this game really uh, showed how much we don't give up. They do not give up, and they didn't give up in two overtimes today, and now they have a chance to win the WAC title tomorrow at 3 o'clock as they take on New Mexico State, the same team they beat one week ago on last Saturday. Yes, it will be a good one. We'll have all the highlights for you tomorrow starting at 6.